And now it's time for this week's Sports Person of the Week as Devin DeStefano caught up with a local youth baseball player who has gone through quite a bit to get back on the field. My 10U team, they started calling me Honey Bun and it just sticked ever since. Callan Fuller, also known by his teammates and coaches as Honey Bun, has proven to be resilient after overcoming a near tragedy at baseball practice several months ago. The coach hit the ball, it was like a line drive straight to me. I started running to get it. I lost in the light and it just hit me in my face. We were scared. I mean, we, we instantly knew that something was wrong. Callan suffered four orbital fractures, meaning he broke four bones in his face. And because of it, he was sent to Lady of the Lake Medical Center in Baton Rouge, where he had surgery to get his face reconstructed. They're not kids anymore, they're young men. Uh, but a very pivotal point, are, are, they gonna, are they gonna stick with it? Or is this the thing that's gonna make them quit? And from what I understand, the first thing he asked when he woke up is how long is it before I can play again? While Callan was being treated at the hospital in Baton Rouge in March, the Savannah Bananas baseball team happened to stop by to visit the hospital. And Callan made sure to get their attention. And then so they just came by the hospital just to visit patients. And um, he caught a glimpse of them in the hallway and all of a sudden he needed to go get a Coke. So he went down to the Coke machine and just happened to run into the Savannah Bananas. Callan plays for champion baseball and his team knows how special he is on the field, but they also know the quality of his character. Like I told you, he's a selfless player. That's awesome, but um, something that a lot of coaches don't talk about is, you know, not just about the player. They don't talk about the person. Callan's a really good kid, really respectful. Through this journey, Callan has had his biggest supporters rooting him on, and they'll be on his mind when he returns to the field next week. It's been good. I, I know that I have something to come back to at baseball, and it's just really a blessing that I have all these people praying for me.